Okay, it looks pretty quiet. Let's be careful. This is tense. What is this? Tobacco. Nice. Go look through the door. Can't see anybody. So let's see what else we can find. What's this? Canned food. Nice. Some good stuff. Uh, good stuff in here. What's that button mean? Oh, guess that's how you hide. Okay. Some more food. Grab it all. We'll clear off this floor. We'll take a look outside. there's nobody out back. Looks like that might be somebody's hideout. So check it out. Nobody arrived yet? No. Looks like we're okay. Okay, we're full again. I don't think we need either of those things. So we'll leave it there. Well, there's a thing up there. Can you just climb up there? Climb up the wall? No. Okay. Go up this ladder then. Let's see what that thing says. And I guess we'll get out of here. Do not touch an exploded ammunition. Well, that's good advice. Yeah, I think we'll we'll check a couple more piles and then we'll we'll get out of here. Yeah, grab all that stuff. Might as well keep checking while we can maybe find stuff that we can stack. Like these. Might be worth coming back here again as well. Okay, I think that'll do. Let's get out of here. Let's see what happened back at the hideout. Everybody looks alive. That's a good sign. Oh, we got raided. Damn it. Didn't do much harm. We had no weapons. Katie was wounded, but the attackers didn't steal anything. We were able to defend ourselves. That was pretty rough, but everybody's more or less okay. We can, we can have her go in bandage. And we will have Bruno, our cook, make some more meals, I think. We'll, we'll have Pavel go and gather some rainwater, and Bruno go and make some fuel. And we'll make some more food. And Katia can, Katia can go and check the radio real quick. Yep, animals. Let's make some fuel. I really don't want to burn any books. But we might have to. Just, let's just burn some wood. And we'll 
will have Pave will go real quick, make some tools, and then he can go to bed. Bruno can go and cook. Now once everybody's eaten, we can send people off to bed. People who need to rest. How many can we make? Only one, we don't have enough water. We'll make that for now. We're gonna get some more water soon. Katia can go and eat that. Make a, a lock pick for the for tonight. And I think we'll probably go back to the uh, the store. Or maybe that first house. There's still some stuff there we haven't looked at. Oh, someone's at the door. Trader. Not sure that's going to be too useful to us. We don't have a whole lot to trade to him. Well, let's see what he has. He has coffee, drugs. Oh, he has some bullets. Oh, we don't have any guns. Let's see, what might he want? I'd like the tablets, but they're really expensive. We can get some more herbal drugs. Which, you know, they're not as good as the real drugs, but... Coffee. Okay, coffee is apparently cheap. Let's take some coffee. And we'll get some cigarettes for, uh, for Bruno. Get some more food as well. Let's see if we can trade him enough to get those. Maybe the herbs. How many herbs? I'll give you a whole bunch of herbs. A bunch of sugar. Books are worth a bit. I don't want to give him that many. Give him two books. A bit of electronic parts. A couple of weapon parts. Oh. Yeah, okay. That'll work. Again, I don't know if that was a fair deal, but it'll work. Do we have any water yet? No, but it's coming. Katia is content. She's tired, so let's send her to sleep. She's finished her stuff for the day. These two just uh, are just waiting for their meal. Bruno is... Probably might end up being the one to go out tonight. Okay, food is done. Let's see how many we can make now. Okay, we can make our last two meals. We'll eat those and then... Pavel can have a sleep before he goes out. I wonder if we could send two people out. Maybe we should try that. Bruno's gonna stuff his face, then get out of the way for Pavel. And then go sleep. And Bruno's just gonna hang out for a bit. There's not much else for him to do. And we'll go see if he can craft some more filters and get some more water. Oh, we can't make any more filters. Oh well. Go hang out. Nothing else for you to do right now. I guess we could end the day. Small apartment building. Right, there's still some more stuff left to get at the supermarket. 
huge amounts of weapons in there, apparently. Sniper Junction. Sounds dangerous. Small apartment building. Okay, we might have to go raid that place one day, but I'm not down to that yet. I'd rather not steal from people. We will take... Oh, wait. Let's make sure the right person comes. Okay, she's not tired anymore, so we'll have her guard. And we'll have Bruno, I guess, scavenge, because Pavel is still tired. And we'll go to to the the store and hope hope we don't get killed. Now Bruno's not as fast and he can't carry as much as Pavel. So I have to keep that in mind. Let's go upstairs this time. Let's see what we can find. Now we need food. And medical stuff. But we also need crafting supplies. We're getting really low on stuff. Let's see what's in the next room. It's pretty safe. Oh, it's barred from the other side. Okay. Or is it the other side? Well, go, go around then, doofus. Oh yeah, the basement. We should go down there. I thought there was a locked door in this place. I don't remember where it was. Or was it just, uh... boarded? Might have just been a boarded door. This one. Let's see what's on the roof. There's a machine gun fire in the distance there. I don't know if you could hear that on the YouTubes. But I could. And hopefully that's not going to come near us. I'd hate to get shot. Pretty good supplies there. And now he is full. But I want to go see what's in the basement. Where was the ladder? Here. Oh, I didn't mean to run. Good job there's nobody down here. That was dumb. Take what can stack. It gives us a good idea of what is left here as well for deciding if we come back. I want those drugs. Uh, drugs. Yeah, drugs. Medicine. We have a bunch of coffee back home, so we'll leave that. Should probably be looking through the doors here. safe. I thought he was going to go to sleep for a second there. That would have been dumb. Medicine ingredients. Some sugar, that'll stack. So there's still food and medical supplies here. We'll bear that in mind in the future. Oh, we can go see what's in this. That's probably where the good stuff is, right? A locked cupboard where I put my good stuff. Cigarette, some herbal meds, some more stuffs. Oh, those will stack. No, they won't. We have a space. Wait. Did I not... Huh? Why do I have a space all of a sudden? Oh, the lockpick. Right. We'll take the jewelry. So that's a good trade thing. We can't bring anything else, though. 
Yeah, there's definitely lots of good stuff here still. This door is locked, right? Yeah, okay. Let's get out of here. We'll definitely want to come back here tomorrow. Another lock pick if we can afford to make one. And we'll find out what happened while we were gone. One of these days somebody's going to be dead when we get back and that'll suck. So day seven. Oh, Caddy is still alive. Yeah, nothing happened. I have achieved for getting into day seven. Great. Let's have Pavel make some stuff. Or maybe make some filters so we get some more water. Yes, we have no water right now. We don't have much wood either. We might have to do without a meal today. Yeah, we can't even make any filters. Tell me you can make a uh, a thing though. Nope, can't make anything today. All right. So we'll. We'll have everybody grab a little bit of food just to keep them going. They can have a, a tin each and then Bruno here can have a couple of uh, just regular foods. Yeah, one's not going to cut it so we can have two. Then we'll see if we can at least make an, another bed. Because then everybody can just go sleep for a bit. Nah, we literally can't make anything. Do we have uh, any filters? No. So there's no point in trying to get some water. Uh, so I guess uh, Bruno can go to sleep. Caddy can go to sleep, and Pavel can go check the radio. And then that'll be it for the day, I think. Oh, there's somebody at the door. We'll check the radio first. The animals again. Let's go see who this guy is. And I hope he doesn't steal all our shit. What do you want, feller? Oh, lady. She wants to stay with us. She used to be a principal of an elementary school, probably wondering what the reason of my visit could be. Well, honestly, I'm afraid to be alone in this dreadful situation. Would you mind if I stayed with you? I can take care of any children that might be with you. Oh, we don't have any kids. But you can stay, sure. So we have this lady. She loves children. She might come in handy, I guess. But for right now, I think that we're going to have to end the day. At least she, she didn't come to us hungry. Let's see. We'll have Pavel and Katia scavenge. No, we can only have one guy scavenge, so we'll have Pavel do it. Katia and Bruno can be on guard and that lady can sleep in our bed or maybe we, maybe Katia can sleep as well we do have two beds and then I think we'll have to go somewhere else because we really need a pick lock or lock pick rather so we could maybe go to the school but we need a shovel there are homeless homeless people there though might not take kindly to us hanging about. Let's go try this place. There are snipers, but it is nighttime. We might be okay. 
Let's try it. We'll take a risk. First sign of trouble, I'm going to get out of here, though. Oh, crap. That's not me. Yeah, no, I don't want to get shot by the sniper. Definitely not. Bastards in the hotel covers the whole damn street. We could probably get over there. If we move from cover to cover. Let's risk it. Run before he reloads. Okay, we made it. The sniper shot him. He's lucky he didn't kill me. Yeah, probably. What can I do to help you, bud? I don't have any medical supplies. Oh, he's got medicine. So yeah, we can probably help him. Let's let him finish his thing. Someone blocked the entrance to the sewers. That sniper wastes a lot of ammo. I can try, fella. I can try. Let's see what's down here. Something blocking it from the other side. So we have a little bit of a quest. We need to get all the way across the street and back down into the sewers. Let's try it. This is dangerous, though. Go. Can we go down this hole? Nope. Ow! Run! You got shot. Keep running. Just go through the door. Okay, this is a noisy place. Rats. Looks like more rats. I can hear the kid. We can at least clear the, the entrance to the sewers for him, I guess. Take what we can. It's pretty tense. And we're completely full. Yep, we're completely full. Let's open this door so the the guy can hopefully be uh, safe and get back to his kid. Yes, you heard heard me open the door. Get down here. Okay, I'll come with you. Now I'm trusting you here, fella a gun or anything. Are you coming or what? Come on. I'm going to have to get Pavel a bandage when he gets home. Yes, there's no time for self-pity, so get a fucking move on. You can hear the baby crying in here. Well, he's crying. That means he's alive, buddy. That's that's something at least. Now, come on. Oh. Come on, Limpy. You better have some stuff. a 
box beneath the bed. Take as much as you need. Well, thanks, buddy. You might want uh, to come hang out with us. You know, we have a pretty safe place. Okay, yeah, we want that. We want all that jewelry. Most definitely. Wait. There we go. And we'll get rid of some more of these parts. You should come with us, bud. I don't think you're going to, though. Let's go see what's down here, because this apparently isn't his room. Well, we can't take that. We should probably be getting back. We'll just see what's in this cupboard, and then we'll... We'll try and dodge the sniper again and head back home. should probably have gone through the uh, sewers. Would have been safer, but I think we're going to be fine. Get out of here, fella. Day 8. Hopefully things were as good at home. Yeah, what a night. Nothing happened at home.